Syracuse University's newest administrator took to the podium today. Welcome to the campus community by a group of mostly administrators, staff, and faculty. I really appreciate the warm welcome. Provost Gretchen Ritter is Syracuse University's new chief academic officer, the number two to Chancellor Severud. I want to advance academic excellence further here. Speaking to us after the event, Ritter said she's looking forward to increasing partnerships and collaboration with nearby institutions. That, I think among the, the values that I tend to bring in this, to this role is a strong commitment to transparency and fairness. Ritter comes to SU from Ohio State, where she was the dean of their College of Arts and Sciences, a school with more than 19,000 students. There are many things I'm proud of. She said they include an initiative to increase Ohio State's commitment to race and social equity here on Syracuse's campus. So I've been impressed by the level of commitment and attention to diversity, equity, and inclusion and access here. She says she'll make increasing faculty diversity a key priority. It is persistent work. It is work that never gets fully done. Our interview comes on the same day UNC is holding a wellness day following the suicide of one student and the attempted suicide of another. Here at SU. Do you believe that there are things at the university that faculty can do to uh, ease student stress? I think one of the things that our faculty can do is to be kind, caring, and generous. When you start a class, spend a minute checking in with people. She hopes to regularly engage with both faculty and students, even if they're just walking around campus. Please stop me. Say hello. Tell me what you're working on, what you're excited about. Is this a long-term position? Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm, I, I believe we've got an opportunity to really do some things here. And I'm eager to be part of that story. For Ritter, it's a story that's just beginning. Ritter told us about her viewpoint on research, tenure track faculty, free speech, and a variety of other topics. We'll be posting my full sit-down interview with her on our Citrus TV YouTube channel very soon. Sam, Oscar, back to you.